I actually remember wanting to be a boy for a little while so that I could play footy. It's pretty amazing now when you see the young girls on the sidelines look up at us and that's normal for them now. I definitely used to leave work early and probably didn't go for promotions because my aims weren't to scale up the corporate world, it was probably to play better footy. I guess I look at it rather than being sacrificed as choices at the moment, I'm sort of making choices that help my football career. Football does feel like it is in my blood. My uncles have played, my dad played, my, my grandfather as well. My dad's probably someone that I draw a lot of strength from. He's gone through some health battles in the last couple of years. His fight and his strength really does inspire me a lot and also my mum and how she cares for him and sacrifices for our family. I just think it's so important to have visible, strong female role models for these young girls and hopefully inspire that next generation to keep going with sport, whether it's to play at the highest level or just for fun and fitness. I've learnt a lot of good life lessons from playing sports, so I think it's really important. I think the key to long-term success for AFL Women's is continuing off this momentum that we've had from the first year. We can play at the highest level and have our own competition and get paid to play, which is really important. I guess that little girl that loved footy as a sort of six or seven year old is now fulfilling her dream.